What's up, Alchemist? Let's tap into this reading and see what we got going on in this energy. Please take the messages and the energy that closely resonates with you in your situation and leave what doesn't at Hell's Gates. Okay, my Alchemist, and don't forget, we stay cute, speak the truth, and transmute all negative energy. Ashe. You know, we got to bring the shimmy shaker back out, can we shake all that negative energy off before we tap into these messages, before we tap into these energies, okay? Let's see what we got going on in this reading, guys. Thank you for all that tuned into the late night reading yesterday. I had to cut the video short, especially after the Super Mario theme song sounding like tune thingy came on in the end. It completely threw me off. <laughs> But I will do a longer reading on that energy alchemist that we tapped into last night, where it pertains to a life insurance policy and a jealous family member or jealous family members, okay? So I'm not sure it may come up in the reading today, it may not. Let's see what we got going on. Oh, that came out quick. You got hiding something here, alchemist. Something hidden. We got a witch coven. Corrupt case. And we've got listen to lies about you. All right, give me some money, generous for that. we got a family member. So for someone here, you can have a family member that's a part of a witch coven here. This person may also be tied into a corrupt case. This could be a family member here that was spreading lies here about you. Or there could also be a family member that listened to lies about you. One more card, Sarah. Else. You've got poison in. Mm -mm -mm. A setback works in your favor. So let's see what we got going on here, Alchemist. Who's my placeholders? There could be a family member here that may have been attempting to poison you or try to poison you here. I just put a download on the community board about two, three days ago, Alchemist, about this energy of an investigation here being done over someone attempting to poison someone. Text messages coming out about this. So oh, I was supposed to put the witch cover never. Since I instinctively put the family member card, I'll do that instead. And I'll leave these cards at the bottom. A family member that's tied into a corrupt case. Some form of text message evidence here coming out about someone orchestrating something. And now this has poison in here, Alchemist, so I don't really know what this is about. And the reading we got into last night had something to do with a life insurance policy. Someone here being angry that they weren't able to claim on a life insurance policy. So this could be a family member here that was trying to poison you so that they could receive a life insurance policy that they had out on you. Someone here was hiding that they had a life insurance policy here on you. You know, so stay scheming. Motherfuckers trying to get at me. Literally, a setback works in your favor. I feel like someone here could have been trying to create some form of blockage here for you in your life, or in some cases, after me, someone was actually trying to take your life so that they could receive. Whatever setbacks you were dealing with here in the past or delays alchemists, this is being cleansed. Something here is now resurfacing, something is now coming to light. Let's get into this energy, see what we got going on here. December could be very significant here for someone. The month of August could also be significant here too. We got secret that just came out and that landed right on top of poisoning, hiding something. Someone here was hiding that they were making an attempt here on your life. And this also has something to do with a life insurance policy, murder for hire. Good hmm. morning to you, please, Spirit. Thank you. Stalking. So Alchemist, this could be a family member here that's also been stalking you, or this person and their witch coven has been stalking you. This person could have been sending people here to come to your area here to keep tabs on you. These individuals here that were stalking you could have been individuals that were listening to lies here about you. So it's like someone webbed up a story here to make it seem like something that they were doing to you was justified. Someone here who's a part of a cult. Hmm. Someone here could have been trying to seem, someone here could have been trying to make it seem like you were evil or there was something wrong with you. 
we got accomplice and partner in crime. This person here definitely wasn't working alone. Someone here could have sent someone to come towards you here, Alchemist, to have this done. Unseen danger. So for someone here, there could have been someone that you were around. This could be a friend or this could be someone that you may have been connected to romantically in some form of way that was hiding their involvement here, hiding that they were an accomplice here, a partner in crime with this family member here that was trying to sabotage you. So when you were around this person here, this person was unseen danger to you because you didn't see that this person here posed a threat to your life. Yeah, we got regret here, Alchemist. This person may be in regret now, or there could be people who listen to lies about you that may be in regret for their involvement here in targeting you with this family member. Yeah, you've got strategy here at the back of the deck. Someone here was strategizing here on how they were going to sabotage you. I'm guessing it started with them stalking you here. Someone here was trying to get your routine pattern down. Hmm. Give me some money, Jonas, here. Now, with this corrupt case, because law enforcement did come out in the reading that we got into last night, Alchemist, there could be someone here that works in the justice system that could be connected to this. Or a family member may have connections to someone here that works in the justice system. Give me some energy, please, spirit. Evidence, Alchemist, can't make it up. Evidence here has come to light. And we've got false person. I'm not reading these cards out here in reverse today. Evidence has come out here about a false person. I'm picking up the energy of these individuals trying to make it seem like you are a false person here. Listen to lies about you. Someone here could have been trying to make it seem like you were trying to harm someone or you had done something to someone. Also with this corrupt case here, Alchemist, someone here could have been trying to set someone up here in the justice system. Someone here could have had a corrupt case here on you and this could be where this law enforcement may be coming into this. Someone here could have been falsifying evidence here on you to try and get you wrapped up here in a case. So it definitely seems like many individuals here were thinking of different ways on how they were going to sabotage you. In a reading yesterday, arson came out. Knife also came out there as well. And now we have poisoning. Hmm. So someone here was definitely exploring different options here. You've got celebrity. Whoa. This may have something to do with a celebrity. There could be a celebrity that may be getting wrapped up in a corrupt case. Or maybe someone here wanted to be a celebrity by trying to get you out of the way. Yeah, We've got delays, alchemist. The setback works in your favour. And we've got manipulation. So that landed on top of a complex partner in crime. There could be a group of individuals here that were manipulated to work against you and work with these individuals here and trying to sabotage you. So I'm definitely getting a lot of lies being told on you here. For someone here, there could be someone that may have some type of status here or celebrity status. Someone that may be well known that could have had their eye on you. There could be a family member here that could have been jealous here of this and was trying to get you out of the way so that they could have this person's attention here onto themselves. So someone here has definitely been manipulating things. I'm definitely getting manipulation of energy, energy manipulation. Someone here was projecting energy here onto you. This could also be someone here that was trying to destiny swap here with you. We've got life insurance. The voice going all funny as I'm saying that. Hmm. Someone wanted you out of the way so that they could receive. Who's managing on this? Arson. It actually came out there, Alchemist. So this is like the energy that we got into yesterday. That sounds like a spaceship. What the hell is that? Do you guys hear that noise? One second. Maybe it's a plane. <laughs> is it a bird? Is it a plane? It's both. <laughs> now that just sounds weird, like something ripping through the skies. So we have Arsene here, Alchemist. Someone was definitely exploring different options here on how they were going to sabotage you. 
So one way was them trying to set you up here to face imprisonment. Another way here was them trying to poison you to unalive you. Then we have arson here. Life insurance and there could also be building insurance here. Someone here could have been trying to burn down a building so that they could claim insurance off of this. Someone here was going to try and make it seem like something was an accident. Hmm. Thank you, Spirit. We got blackmail. You see where it landed, Alchemist? Whoever was working with this individual is now blackmailing this family member. Money, 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 money. Money. Thief. Some of you could have been trying to steal something here from someone. It's a lot of motives in this energy, Alchemist. So you gotta take the energy how it resonates to your situation. Someone here could have been plotting on your life because they wanted you out of the way to claim a life insurance policy that they had on you. Had it on you. Where's these accents coming from now? Someone here could have been trying to get you out of the way because someone here may have had their eye on you that wanted to make a move on you and this person didn't want you to get with this person. Someone here could have been trying to get you out of the way because they wanted your destiny. And the only way they could do this if you were no longer here. It's a lot that's been going on in this. <clears throat> Either way, this is a lot of individuals here that were in devil energy here against you. Yeah, lies. Listen to lies about you here, Alchemist, and we've got rope. It's like someone here was trying to leave you out to hang. Or someone was trying to hang you publicly. I'm speaking meth methodically. Method oh Lord. Metaphorically. Whoever's energy this is that I'm tapping into, this person's very illiterate. All right, you may have a family member that may not know how to speak. Someone here may be dyslexic, okay? Someone here was definitely telling a lot of lies on you. I'm getting a lot of energy manipulation and energy projection here. It's like someone projecting their energy onto you whilst they were stealing your energy so that they could walk in your energy. Someone trying to walk in your light here. Someone wanted to embody your energy and they were doing this here by force. So, it's like someone made a lot of plans here, Alchemist. The first plan, let me assassinate this person's character so that people can look at them a certain type of way, people can detach away from them. Once I have this person isolated, then I can start attacking them even more. I'll use the people that I also manipulated to work with me because now they believe what I've told about this person here to be true. After this happens, then we can all group up together and attack this person so I can get this person out of the way. So I can either claim on something that I have on them or so I can receive something that was due to them. It's either one or the other, Alchemist. Someone definitely had a well thought out plan here. Stage one, stage two, stage three, stage four. Shit, someone may have stage four cancer. We got a rope here. Someone has hanged themselves here. Someone was trying to hang you on this rope like a public lynching so that everyone would see and there's like they were gonna get a mob or they had a mob here because this witch coven is most definitely a mob and these people that were lynching you were gonna feel justified in what they were doing to you whole time you were innocent hmm. so lies landed on top of secret whatever secrets this person or these individuals have been hiding from this coven they're all coming out Everything this person was saying about you is now being exposed as lies. And I feel like there could be many individuals here in this coven that may know this and could be blackmailing this individual. we got justice out there in reverse alchemist. I said I ain't reading these cards out here in reverse today, but I'm going to take this out here. Some form of corruption is definitely going on here. Hmm. Someone falsifying something here. Gathering up false evidence could also be significant. False reports. This coven or family member could have been making false reports on you here. We got sex here at the back of the deck. For someone here, someone could have been trying to make it seem like you were a sex worker. There could be a family member in your family that is a sex worker here, Alchemist. If this is someone here that was trying to destiny swap here with you. Someone was trying to walk in your light by trying to project their false energy onto you by trying to make it seem like you live their life whilst they live your life. This is all coming out. Evidence, yeah. Thank you, spirit. Death, alchemist. Evidence is coming out here about someone who is planning your death. So it feels like 
these people wanted you out the way so that their lies against you would never be uncovered as the lies that they are someone here is angry here that you're still alive and now their lies are being exposed a lot of things have been hidden here i'm getting a lot of secrecy code of silence if you're no longer alive then you wouldn't have the opportunity to defend yourself and speak your truth then it would make it seem like everything these people were doing to you here was justified when it wasn't so it's like they were quickly trying to get you out of the way so you wouldn't ever be able to speak your truth or defend yourself someone may also be hiding a death Ooh. bloodline evidence here is coming out here about this false bloodline alchemist and we got knife. There's like many people here stuck a knife here in your back. They betrayed you because they had their own agendas. Jealousy, greed, envy, spite. There's a lot, yeah. Lured. Someone here was trying to lure someone here to their death. And then we got imprisonment. Someone here was definitely trying to set someone up. Warning. And we've got curse. I feel like alchemist someone had already put some type of energy onto you so that when people would be around you or when they would see you they would look at you in a false light they would look at you as if you were a false person mm -hmm. so this is something here that was done unbeknownst to you so maybe when you were around people people could have been acting funny towards you people could have been abusing you misjudging you here People weren't taking you seriously. People thought something was off of you. But this was the energy that someone in your family or a group of individuals were putting onto you. Whatever energy they embody, they had like transferred their energy onto you. You could have gone through a phase in your life here where you were taking a lot of losses as a result of this. Also, if this projected energy here, if these people are also trying to have you investigated. For some form of corrupt case they were trying to have out on you is so that the justice system would also look at you like you were a false person there's a lot of warfare that's been going on here alchemist this is really dark energy here that's been used you see how she's got red smeared on her face like someone was trying to smear you or smear campaign someone was trying to stain your reputation it's like someone digging dirt Someone could have been digging up dirt on you or false dirt. Their hands are dirty because they've been digging up dirt here on you or they were trying to dig your grave. And then um, say you're wearing a white t-shirt, Alchemist, they're rubbing their dirty hands on you. And then they get the police to come and look. Look, look, it was them. They did it. Look, they, they even have the stains on them. They're dirty. Look at their t-shirt. Look at them. But your hands are clean because you haven't been digging the dirt. But the t-shirt that you were wearing is stained. I'm speaking metaphorically again, Alchemist. Someone was doing things and then they were putting the things that they were doing onto you. Everything this person was doing, they were trying to make it seem like it's you. You are someone's scapegoat here. They were smearing your name and they were also trying to make you a scapegoat here to their crime. Yeah, this is strong manipulation, Alchemist. Greed. I feel like you are around many individuals here who are greedy. Many people who wanted to claim, many people who wanted to receive. Yeah, we've got distraction here and we've got hidden. So Alchemist, for however long this has been going on, you could have been distracted from this. You probably didn't know this was happening because you were going through a lot of losses here in your life. So it's, this is very meticulous. This is very meticulous. At the same time, you were going through a lot of chaos and conflict in your life whilst you were also dealing with a lot of delays. The very same people that were orchestrating this chaos and conflict here, they had orchestrated the chaos and conflict so that you would be distracted, so that their schemes and plots against you would be hidden. Oh, yo, this is really mad. Mm -hmm. Then we got royalty right after that alchemist. Hidden royalty. Someone here didn't want you to know who you truly were. It feels like many individuals knew who you were. Someone wanted you to forget yourself. And this is why I'm also picking up people here trying to destiny swap here with you. Someone wanted your life. There could be someone here in your family that could have been imitating you. If this is a feminine here, 
say a masculine tried to talk to this feminine, this feminine could have been giving these masculines your name and acting as if they were you. This is really mad. Someone here could have got caught up here for a crime and they could have used your name and said that it was you. The evidence is now coming to light, Alchemist. There's so much going on here. Yeah, evidence is coming to light. Murder for hire, accomplice partner in crime. The individuals that worked with these people here to sabotage you, some of these people may be speaking out to try and save themselves. But someone here is definitely being blackmailed here at this time. Someone here knows the truth. Someone here knows that you were innocent and that these people conjured up these lies here because of their greed, because they wanted to receive. Someone offered you up as a sacrifice, so they sacrificed your stability. They tried to assassinate your character, or they did assassinate your character. Someone just wanted you to be taking losses after losses to eventually lost your life. This was all thought out here, Alchemist. This is mad. Someone hired a hitman as well. Someone needed someone to get close to you so you were around a false person, premeditated. This was all planned, Alchemist. Look, premeditated and we've got rope there. It's like, say something had happened to you here with this poisoning energy and God forbid, because it was never going to happen, Alchemist. Have you ever seen like them, I shouldn't even compare it to a movie because this actually happens in real life where it seems like someone has unalived themselves, but really and truly someone has taken them out, but they've, set up the scene to make it seem like they did it to themselves so someone wanted to make it seem like you hung yourself someone here wanted to make it seem like you poisoned yourself you took yourself out and then they would have been like oh yeah it's because they they were who i said that they were that's why they did that but everything was lies this is strong manipulation i really can't even put my finger on this but this is very sinister It's like these people were trying to make it seem like you were evil or you were wicked or you lived some type of lifestyle and this had eventually caught up to you and this is why you took yourself out. But you didn't take yourself out. These people had orchestrated this, but then they were going to make it seem like it was an accident. Hmm. We got sex here, Alchemist. Now that line on top of evidence here, there could be evidence coming out about someone in your family here that's a sex worker. This person here could have been projecting this energy onto you to try and make it seem like you are a sex worker. There could be a family member that could be hiding that they were a sex worker here. It's a lot that's coming out. We've got surveillance. And we've got social media. Something here could be coming out on social media. Someone may be blackmailing someone here that could be a sex worker in your family, alchemist. Like, hey, I know what you do. Or I know what you've done. Someone may be putting something out about this individual here if they don't pay them. I think I also picked up in the reading last night here, alchemist, about someone here being in debt and someone trying to use someone else to pay off their debt. So say someone here was trying to set you up. Someone here could have been being blackmailed here because they didn't want what they do for work to come out. So someone in your family could have been trying to set you up to have you out of the way so that they could have money to pay this person. There's a lot going on here. Either way, it's like the main focus has been you. People have chosen to use you, target you here to cover up their dealings. Everything that these people do, they put it onto you to make it seem like you are who they are. This is a serious form of energy manipulation. Here yeah, we got memories. These are people you want shared memories here with Alchemist. Hmm. I was about to say, what the hell is that noise? 
it's the maintenance man cleaning the communal area. We got a salt. Now that line on top of manipulation there, Alchemist. Definitely getting a lot of distractions here. Someone in your family could have lied and said that you assaulted them or you put your hands on them. Wow. This is really mad. This is really mad, Alchemist. Like, what the, what the hell is this? I'm going to get some more energy with this with the tarot cards because this is mad. Let me use the Kipper deck first. For someone here, a female cousin could be significant or a mother figure could be significant. You know, growing up, if you ever had parents that were abusive in any type of way, like they put their hands on you, you see how the person has their hand out like that? Like, say you were trying to block your mother or your father from hitting you. Let's get back into this. Whenever people would try and defend themselves from getting beat, the parents would start exaggerating and try and make it seem like you've attacked them. So say you try and block your mother or your father from beating you. The moment you put your hand up to like block their attack here, they're going to be like, oh my gosh, they try to beat me. They go and tell all their friends or their inner circle. They go to church. Oh my gosh, my daughter or my son put their hands on me. The whole time you were defending yourself from this person attacking you. These people are very manipulative. Like the older generation and i think it has something to do with whatever trauma that they faced in their lifetime that they never healed from they ended up putting that onto their children projecting it onto their children not all of them for some of you could have had parents here that had favorites within the family a lot of favoritism here some families favor the son more than they favor the daughters or some cases here there could be a family member here that could have favored other family members over you you could have been the only one here that was isolated because you were different something here was different about you hmm. this is like a serious narcissistic tactic here everything these people have been doing to you they try and make it seem like you've been doing to them if these are people that were stealing from you, they try and make it seem like you were stealing from them. If these are people that were lying on you, they try and make it seem like you're lying on them. If these are people that were manipulating you, they were trying to make it seem like you were manipulating them. If these are people that were plotting and scheming on you, they try and make it seem like you're plotting and scheming on them. Narcissists never take accountability. They always have to project what they do onto other people. They always have to project their insecurity onto other people. And it seems like alchemist, for some of you, you've grown up in a whole family of narcissists. And these people targeted you here because you were different from them. You weren't toxic like them. You weren't manipulative like them. You weren't greedy like them. Because you were different here, these people saw you as a threat. So they said, okay, let's target this person. They don't want to do what we're doing. They don't want to be like us. Let's shun them out. Let's exile them or let's sacrifice them. Your difference here is key. Your difference was a threat to all of these individuals. It's like these people wanted you to be like them so bad. They wanted you to be like them so bad whilst they were all pretending to be like you. Now, I'm not saying we're perfect here in life, Alchemist, but there's a very difference. There's a big difference here in how these people have lived their life and how you have lived your life. Let's hop into this. Let's get some energy with the tip of deck. I'm getting a female cousin, a mother figure. As well, could also be significant for someone here, an auntie. An uncle. We've got poverty out there and reverse alchemist. There's a group of individuals here that didn't want to be in poverty. Some of these individuals here could have been in debt here for a while. And in order to offset their debt here, they offered you up. It's like someone here offered you up here to the devil to pay off their debt. If they could sacrifice you, they would win it big. Now someone here is in debt with the devil. We've got a main male. Now that land on top of hiding something. So for someone here, there's a main male that could be hiding something. This could be a main male here in your family. Hmm. This could be a main male that listens to lies about you. For some of you, this could be an ex-lover. Someone here also didn't want to be in poverty. So for someone, there could be someone from your past that may have been facing poverty. This person could have taken a proposition here from a family member to sabotage you. To poison you. 
or to steal something from you. Or this person works with your family here to steal something from you. Yeah, we got a false person. That landed right on top of manipulation. So when you were dealing with this person, your alchemist, this person was a false person to you. This person was plotting and scheming with these very same individuals here. This person here could have feigned ignorance and acted as if they didn't know what was going on. Arson. Evident. Someone here could have been trying to set your home on fire. Your expectation. This is really mental, y'all. Like, I'm getting a lot of messages that are coming through as I'm in this energy. And it's, it really blows my mind how people think and how people behave. For someone here, this plan that these individuals had on you here was to poison you and then to have some form of arson done on your home. So you would have been out of it, passed out, you would have, you know, wouldn't have been awake, obviously, to know what was happening. And then someone here was going to set fire to the property that you were in. And then try to make it seem like it was an accident. People in your family here could have been spreading lies to say that you were someone who does drugs or you're strung out on drugs. So someone here could have been like trying to plan it so that you would take some form of poison here. AKA whatever drugs they were trying to give to you. Something that was going to knock you out. And then they were going to make it seem like oh, she was strung out on drugs or he was strung out on drugs. And they left something on the stove and that's why there was a fire in their home. But this was all orchestrated. This was all planned. This is mad. Cool. What's my energy, please, spirit? We've got Pathway. Somewhere along your pathway, Alchemist, you met a false person. I feel like somewhere along your pathway, you've met a lot of false people. You met a lot of people here who didn't have your best interest at heart. People who took advantage here of your kindness. People who only sought to manipulate you, use and abuse you, steal from you, lie to you. For some of these people, they could have put their hands on you. They could have been physically abusive. I'm just getting the energy of many individuals trying to paint an image about you to other people to make it seem like something was wrong with you and you deserved what was being done to you. So people willingly participated in this because they felt like you deserved this. It's just, you know, I don't know if you want to tap out of this energy. You've got unexpected income here. Now that landed on top of death and assault. There could be a main male here that could have been paid here to beat you up or assault you. Someone here that was paid to put their hands here on you. Yeah, someone here was pro um, promised, produced. Protestant? Someone here was promised sudden bath, your alchemist. If they could sabotage you in some type of way or if they could keep you in a low vibration. If someone here was paid to come into your life just to use you and abuse you, it's like someone was trying to reinforce to you that you were unworthy and undeserving of true and genuine love. You could have come across a lot of people here in your life on your pathway here that didn't have your best interest at heart and only wanted you for what they wanted you for. So when you came across this person, this person could have first acted as if they had your best interest at heart. If you look at the pathway card, there's a light at the end of the path. This person came in acting as if they were going to be a light here on your path. They were going to be with you on your path. They were going to guide you or they were going to protect you in some type of way. But this person here was sent to you here to destroy you, to dim your light. Someone was just in your life to reinforce what other people may have instilled in you growing up here. Family members that you were unworthy, you were undeserving or something is wrong with you because you're different. Someone just wanted you to stay stuck in a low vibration here. Someone here was promised unexpected income here if they could put some form of death and ending here to you. Murder for hire. So whoever was around you, Alchemist, this false person, this person was hiding their true agendas. They were basically the hitman. I said hitman instead of hitman. Because I'm really getting the energy of multiple individuals being sent to you with the same motive. One person fails, they send another. One person fails, they send another. Someone was very adamant on getting you out of the way. Yeah. 
People here were consistently thinking of plots and schemes here on how to end you. Someone here could have deliberately picked fights here with you just so that they could have a false reason to put their hands on you. Like someone provoking you and say you speak out or you defend yourself, pow, they slap you up. Like someone's falsely justifying who they are. Someone's just abusive. We've got a mature man. For someone here, a father figure or, or uncle could be significant. A stepfather may also be significant here for someone. This is really mental, your alchemist. <sighs> this person here is in concern, alchemist. Concern just landed right on top of mature man. Someone here is in concern because they're not able to claim on something they wanted to claim. This person's greed has caught up to them. For some of you, this is a mature man that was trying to steal something here from you. This could be your destiny or this could even be something that was left to you. An inheritance could be significant for someone or a trust fund. Or this may even be a life insurance policy here that was left to someone. That someone wanted to receive by getting you out of the way. Oh, this is really, I really want to tap out of this alchemist because this is getting, <laughs> it's getting me mad right now. I'm hearing a lot of things right now. People claiming you're incompetent. People claiming you're a drug addict. People could have been claiming you were a drug dealer. People claiming you're a sex worker. It's just the worst. You're abusive, you're manipulative, you're a liar, everything. Everything these people are, they were putting it onto you. And people actually believe these people and they work with them to sabotage you, to harm you. Now this person is in concern that everything they try to do here is now coming out. With a fucking family like this, who needs enemies, for real? You got great fortune now, because this is all behind great fortune and that landed on the floor, hiding something. Someone here was hiding that there was some form of great fortune here that was left to you. They didn't tell you this, but they were plotting and scheming here to end your life so they could receive this. They were plotting and scheming to set you up here so they could receive this. Someone wanted the power of attorney here over something that was willed to you. Yeah, because someone here wanted to be a wealthy man. This mature man could have promised a main male that they would be a wealthy man with them if they worked with them and sabotaging you. Occupation. Someone here could have met someone here at work or sent someone that they knew from their job here to come towards you. Or something about someone's occupation is very significant. Some of these individuals could have been telling lies here to your employers, getting people to call in here, they sabotage your stability. These people are, are not, they're not right. They're not right. They're not right. It's like the lengths people will really go to to destroy people's lives all because of materialistic things. To see how far people really go to destroy people's lives just so that they can receive something that's destined to that person. Uh, every time I tap into the energies like this, Alchemist, it doesn't matter how many readings I do like this, it still bewilders me. It really does. People that you grew up with, like people who had known you since you were a child for them to do stuff like this to you. It just shows these people are heartless. It shows these people are so discontent in their life. No, man. <sighs> yeah, message of concern and that landed right on top of concern here, Alchemist. These individuals have received the message of concern. A mature man has received the message of concern. We've got courthouse here at the back of the deck. Someone here has been summoned to court. Evidence has come to light. Everything these people have orchestrated and planned against you is now coming out, alchemists. The truth is now coming out. The truth is now coming out. This is mad. It feels like this has been a real long time coming. Because so I've done these readings since about last year, Alchemist. And honestly, this... It really just... There's just no words for it. Like, it really is no words for it. We've got courthouse and we've got message. Someone has definitely received the message of Alchemist, a court summing. We've got imprisonment right after that. 
This is overwhelming evidence that's coming to light here about these individuals and their plots and their schemes. I'm telling you, someone here was working very, very hard, Alchemist, to make sure you'd never have any form of peace in your life. Bad health. Someone here was also working hard here to put you in bad health. Someone here could have received the message that they are in bad health. Someone here may have some form of cancer here. Some form of sickness or disease, but I'm not going to lie to you. When you are mentally sick the way that you are sick enough to orchestrate these things against someone's life, an innocent person's life here, all that sickness that roams within your mind is only going to manifest within your vessel. It's only going to manifest within your vessel. For some of you, these people could have been orchestrating these things here since you were a child. Putting things here into place, putting things here into effect. The abuse that they inflicted on you in your childhood here was always a part of their plan. Because they wanted to make sure you felt worthless and unworthy and undeserving. So you'd always attract negative things or negative people. Because you'd be in such a low vibration as a result of the trauma that you faced here in your childhood. These people knew what they were doing. And this was all behind some form of great fortune they wanted to receive. Someone here wanted to be privileged of something here that was left to you, something that was destined to you. So they worked very hard to tear you down, tear your character down, tear your confidence down, tear your self-esteem down, tear your stability down. They just needed you to be down and in the end they wanted you to be gone, death. They wanted you to feel as if your life wasn't worth living when they were the ones orchestrating all these events to make it seem like your life wasn't worth living. It's, it's horrific. You know, it's... Uh, God, Alchemist, I had to take a little break just then. It's horrific. Mm -hmm. Let me just get a few cards, Alchemist, before we tap out of this, because... <sighs> mm -hmm. This point, humans, they don't surprise me anymore. When you've seen the worst, what else can you do? When you've seen the worst in life, what else can you really do? Hmm. Give me some energy on this. We've got the King of Pentacles here. That land right on top of the mature man. Give me some energy on the King of Pentacles. Someone here definitely wanted to be sitting on top of finances. Someone wanted to live that life. They wanted to be wealthy. They wanted to be abundant. We got the five of swords here, Alchemist. Now someone here is defeated. This king of pentacles here is now defeated. For someone here, this could have been someone that may have had some form of wealth here in the past. Someone here could have lost a lot of money or lost a lot of investments. And when they found out some form of great fortune here was left to you, this person started scheming the moon. This person started casting illusions about who you were. They started doing things here to you here so that you wouldn't feel like you were deserving of something. The magician, I can't make up alchemist. This person started manipulating your energy. They started manipulating how other people viewed you. They told a lot of lies here on you. The hang, I can't make this up alchemist. All the cards are in formation. Because this person wanted to sacrifice you. They wanted to trap you. They wanted you to have a distorted view here over the world. Whilst also having people have a distorted view over you. This person wanted you to be in this five of swords feeling defeated. Now this king of pentacles here is defeated. The earth sign could be significant. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We've got five in the mature man card. This person could be a Taurus. Give me some energy on the spirit. We got the Page of Swords. A minor could be significant in this energy here. Someone here was very calculating, or someone was calculating something, planning something since you were a child. Page of Swords. Someone here could have been trying to put some form of death and ending here to you since you were a child. We got the Empress. Wow. That lands right on top of evidence here, Alchemist. Someone here was plotting and scheming on the empress, or this could be an empress that has a child. Hmm. Need some energy on this one, divine. Temperance alchemist. That landed right on the five of swords and the page of swords. For someone here, if you have children, these individuals could have turned your children away from you by spreading lies about you, trying to say that you were incompetent or there was something wrong with you. 
you know, the damage, like, this is... It's not right what people do here in this world, all for materialistic things. But when you've been awakened to things like this alchemist, I really do feel like it may even shift your perspective on life in general. You can't unsee what you have seen. Balance here is being restored, alchemist. It's being restored. If your children turned away from you as a result of the lies someone was telling you, for someone this could even be an ex-spouse or someone here in your family, a father figure. If someone wanted people to look up to them and they wanted people to look down on you. So this King of Pentacles mature man here could even be someone that acted as if they were a mentor, a guide. But this person is someone that misguides people. They lie. They manipulate. They use. They abuse. Lies and manipulation. This person was using heavy manipulation tactics here to get their way. Someone who has the gift of the gab. This person was using the fact that people did look up to them here to manipulate these people here into doing their bidding for them. Because who's going to doubt this person? This is the type of man where people be like, oh, I've known this person all my life. They would never do something like that. Or oh, I've known this person all my life. They must be telling the truth. Why would they have to lie? Because they want money. Because they're greedy. Because they're materialistic. Because they're selfish. Why wouldn't they have to lie? If this is someone that once had a very wealthy life, he's got a globe there, well-traveled. Someone who's very knowledgeable here. If at one stage in this person's life they were very well off, they may have had businesses here, they may have had connections here, and then something happened in their life where they ended up losing a lot of investments or they lost their businesses, this person still wanted to live that high life. They still wanted to travel the world at your expense. They still wanted to wear fancy suits at your expense. King of Pentacles, he's got a lot of jewellery. This person could love watches here. They wanted to buy the best and the finest things at your expense. They wanted to continue sitting on this throne here, holding that coin at your expense. Why wouldn't they have to lie? If they want to maintain the image that they have and they don't want people to know that they have lost a lot here, things are falling apart in their life, of course they're going to lie and manipulate. If they know they have the control of other people here and they have people putty in their hands, of course they're going to lie and manipulate. People need to wake up and stop deluding themselves. You could have seen the truth about who this person was here, Alchemist, growing up with this individual. If this is a father figure, if this is an uncle, for some of you, this could be a stepfather. You saw that this person wasn't who they were portraying themselves to be. For some of you, this could be someone here that may have assaulted you, that may have put their hands on you, that could have even violated you. You saw that this person here was a fraud. Someone who's very deceptive. But they wanted to maintain their image here in public. And in order to do that, they had to assassinate your character here to maintain their image. And not just that, then steal from you on top of it. But that was their motive all along. Balance here is being restored, Alchemist. Give us some energy here. We got the two of pentacles. That landed right on the temperance. If at any stage here you were juggling and struggling here with your finances, alchemist balance is being restored. A setback works in your favour. Someone here wanted to make sure you never had any form of stability in your life. And I also feel like this person wanted you to be in this two of pentacles because they wanted you to be dependent on them. They wanted this image that they are someone who takes care of their family. Like they take care of you. If someone was trying to make it seem like you were incompetent, they wanted you to lack financially because they were trying to paint an image or a narrative that they take care of you. Oh, I give them money. They're not good with their finances. I give them money. The money that they were stealing from you. This person is mental. <sighs> Six of Swords here, Alchemist. Now, someone here is trying to escape here to calmer waters. This person may be trying to escape from this situation. Give me some energy on the Six of Swords. The devil, and land around on top of the mature man alchemist out there in reverse. Someone knows a contract here has failed. Someone here could have put you in some form of bind here with the devil alchemist or some of you since you were a child. 
a contract here where you would take losses and they would receive gains. Some of you could have had you in a 10 year contract. So for the next 10 years of your life, whenever they made this contract here, Alchemist, you would take losses and they would receive gains. You would lack and they would receive. You wouldn't have any favor, they would be favorable. That's the contract this person made here with the devil. And eventually here, some form of death and ending here would come to your life so that they could receive a big payout. This was all planned, this was all orchestrated. The devil was out there in reverse, this contract has been broken, it has been severed. And that's why this person is now trying to escape. Someone is in debt to the devil. Someone here could have been using you to pay off their debt. I just mentioned that earlier on. I just mentioned that earlier on, Alchemist. Eight of Pentacles. He's working very hard. He has a like a blueprint there of a plan. Someone who once owned businesses here. Someone who was once wealthy. Someone lost a lot. Someone here was in heavy debt. Someone needed you to pay off their debt. If they could get you out of the way, they would be able to pay their debt and then receive some. And then some from your death. Confirmation with the crow alchemist. I'm telling you, this person is wicked. Let me some more energy here, hold the land. We've got a sun card out there in reverse. Someone who was heavily operating out of their ego. Someone didn't want to give up a lifestyle that they were living. They didn't want to give up the fancy cars. They didn't want to give up their position here in whatever community that they were in. This is someone who feels like the only way people will look up to them is if they have money, if they have power, if they have status. This person offered you up as a sacrifice so that they could receive all of this or continue having this. They didn't want people to know the truth that they were struggling. They didn't want people to know the truth that they were in debt. They didn't want people to know the truth here, possibly that they were sick in some form of way. Mentally sick, most definitely. This person has been working very hard here to keep the truth hidden, Alchemist. Hiding something. With the sun out there in reverse, this person here was trying to dim your light. They didn't want any form of sun to shine in your life. They wanted you to be in the dark. Whilst they stole your light. Six of Pentacles at the back of the deck whilst they stole a gift from you. For some of you, this may even be your spiritual gifts. This could be someone that was very envious here of your spiritual gifts. Yeah. Since you were a child. This is really mad. Page of Wands. Thank you, Spirit. The magician out there in reverse, Alchemist. Everything has fallen apart for this individual now. Everything has backfired on this person. Everything is now unraveling for this person. The same rope they were trying to hang you with is the same rope they've hanged themselves with. I don't know if that's going to be physically, Alchemist. I mean, if it was, there would be a strong admission to guilt. Cowards like this, they can never face themselves. If this person could never face the reality of the situation that they were in all these years, it's highly unlikely they're going to face it now. It's highly unlikely they're going to face it now. If they spent years of their life destroying you, assassinating their character, only for people to find out this person was the living, walking devil themselves. Of course, they're going to try and take the coward's route out. Six of Swords. This person wanted to back you into a corner. They wanted to devour you. And now that everything has turned back onto this person, now they want to escape this. In whichever way they're trying to escape it, whether they're trying to flee or they're trying to take themselves out here to escape facing judgment for what they've done. Six of Cups, this is definitely someone here in your family, Eight of Swords. Someone he doesn't want to face imprisonment. This person was always a coward for everything they did to you anyway. They were always a coward. Something that backfired on a group of individuals. And this could even be why this community, this coven that they were working with now know this person is a liar and a deceiver. This person isn't who they portrayed themselves to be. Yeah, Alchemist, evidence is coming out. 
This person is now in this hangman position. They are now trapped. It's raining today. It's raining quite heavy right now, actually. Something here is being cleansed up. Something is being cleared up. It's like for your whole life, this person wanted there to be a cloud here over your life. A dark cloud that would consistently follow you. That dark cloud was them. So when people would see you, they'll think you're just negative. You're a low vibrational person. You ain't got nothing going on for your life. This person wanted you to embody their energy whilst they were stealing your energy so that they could embody your energy. The cycle is done, Alchemist. Let's get the specifics, Alchemist, so we'll close this reading up. All right, so we got New York. All right, we've got a Taurus. You could be a Taurus, or this could be a Taurus involved in this if you've got Florida. Slough. And we've got Trinidad and Tobago. We've got Mexico. All right, we've got Queenstown. We've got Louisiana. All right, we've got Albania. We've got Pakistan, Bangladesh, and we've got Mali. We've got Uganda, and we've got Brighton, and we've got Philadelphia. All right, we've got Congo, Manchester. All these cards are falling out on the freaking floor. We got Pisces. You could be a Pisces, or this could be a Pisces involved in this. We got Porsche, Reading. We got Merseyside, and we've got the Netherlands. All right, we got initials R, and we've got South Africa. We got Scotland. Haiti, we got Detroit, we got Aries, you could be an Aries or this could be an Aries involved in this, we got initials D, we got Southampton, all right we got Poland, we've got initials F, Cancer. You could be a cancer or this could be a cancer involved in this. All these cards that are falling out on the floor. We got London. Canada and we've got initials T. We've got Maryland. And we've got initials C. We got Greece. And we've got France. We've got initials Q. And we've got Bristol. Alright, we've got a Libra. You could be a Libra or this could be a Libra involved in this. We've got initials K. Alright, we also have Ghana. We've got a Capricorn. You could be a Capricorn or this could be a Capricorn involved in this. All right, we've got a Scorpio. You could be a Scorpio. This could be a Scorpio involved in this. We've got initials P. Memphis. We've got initials E. And we've got Nigeria. We've got Essex. And we've got initials O. And we've got Sri Lanka. We've got initials S. We've got a Gemini, you could be a Gemini, this could be a Gemini involved in this. We've got initials V. 
We got initials U. And we've got initials Z. And we've got initials L. New Zealand. And we've got Somalia. A couple more. I'll we'll close this up. We got initials A, U A E. Something about Dubai is significant. We got Philippines. All right, we got Wales, and we've got a Leo. So what do we have here? Leo, Cancer, Scorpio. Pisces. So water sign is very significant. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We got a Taurus, Gemini, we got a Capricorn, and Libra, and we got Aries. We got Aquarius here at the back. The name Kwame could be significant. Aquasi. The name Liam could be significant or Leanne. His name could be Eunice. Initial Z. The name Zambele could be significant. P. Patesh or Patel. We got initial C. The name Chloe or Charlie could be significant. Or Chris. Initials V, Victoria, Vincent. I'm sure with those other initials there. Specifics are Alright, we got 999 release what no longer serves you. We got Zambian. Something here about a Zambian hiding something. Zambian. The name Andrew could be significant. Alright, we got a lab technician. We got a nose piercing or ring. All right, brown eyes, and we've got past life karmic. It could be an Aquarius with a nose piercing or ring, past life karmic. Associates of a friend and warning, warning. It could be someone here or a group of individuals that were working with people that they knew their friends here to sabotage you, to watch you, to spy on you, or to do things here online. Cyberbullying could be significant here. All right, we've got Asian. Sudden fatality, warning, warning. We got 1111 11, Alchemist Alignment with the Divine. It could be a sudden fatality here for a Capricorn. British. Something about a British lab technician. We got Volkswagen. We got a Chevy. 1188 Alchemist Grass. Every opportunity. What's that? 1313 Welcoming Growth and Changes. Okay. We got a healthcare worker. Something here about a healthcare worker hiding something. Someone here could have been hiding documents. Or falsifying medical documents here. They've got multiple ear piercings. This could be people in your family that were falsifying medical documents here against you to paint you here in a false light. It's all coming out, alchemist. Evidence. Everything these people have done and invested against you, alchemist, is all being revealed. It's all being exposed. Someone's name could be Al or Alan. All right, 12, 12, contentment within life. Must atone for their sins. We've got a Tesla and we've got an ex-lover. For some of you, it's an ex-lover here that was sent to you by your family to come towards you, to poison you, to sabotage you. It's all coming out. Jamaica. Someone here could be from Jamaica. Someone's Jamaican. We've got Oto to chase your dreams. One, two, three, four, new begin beginnings at your door. We've got passed over. We got fiance or fiance, and we got Range Rover. I'm sure initial C came out. Someone think could be Chai. 
Audi, Distant Relative, Facetap, SUV, we got American. All right, Mixed Breed, and we got 000, Pause and Reflect. And we got 1619, Kendra Space, Kendra Mine. Could be someone here who's maybe mixed that may be hiding something. Someone's ex love. We got three one three. Keep on going. All right, we got a cousin. Athlete, and we got IT engineer. Ticking time bomb, and we got a road man or a street dude. Seventeen seventeen. Focus on the task at hand. We got seven eleven. Fresh start in your area code, and we got Middle Eastern. 1010, your life is heading in a new direction. We've got electrician, likes cooking or baking, online business, and we've got in-laws, and we've got works from home. Someone may have an online business here, someone that works from home. Full, 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 I'll commence divine protection. They will reap what they sold against you. Something, someone here could have been doing something online here against you. We've got immigrant, grandparent, well, if you do something online, someone here could have been trying to sabotage you. We've got braids or twist. Free, free, free alchemist. Your angels and your guides are with you. Illegal status. And we've got grandparents. 2244 four, alchemist. You're on the right path. And we've got high and die. All right. We've got Portuguese. Italian. Someone between the ages of 45 to 59. Someone may drive a smart car. We've got Trinidadian. Oto to have faith in yourself. You also have a beautician. Something about a beautician that was also hiding something. Sells cosmetics. 411, a divine union is coming together. A beautician that sells cosmetics. Someone may have an online business selling cosmetics. All right. 1222 Alchemy is a well balanced season ahead for you. All right. We've got unemployed. And we've got West. Something about someone that lives on the West side. 3344, three, four, stay focused. 808, connect to the divine. 3838, 38, utilize your abilities. All right, 1414, 14, important decision ahead here for someone. We've got admin and social worker, and we've got a raster man church folk 155 detached from the situation judgment call something about a pastor <sighs> these people man we got nissan 211 alchemy something is caring for you and we got walks with a limp leg 1221 something new will grow for you all right 2222 you're going for a powerful spiritual growth we got tinted windows and we've got east. Think about someone that lives on the east side, south or southeast. 0101, refrain from the situation or scenario where you feel trapped. 666, realign your thoughts. We've got a factory worker. I can't even tell you how many people were involved in this alchemist. I just can't even tell you. Almost, I shouldn't even say almost. Basically, everyone you came across in your life, even those you once grew up with, Alchemist, they were involved in this scheme and trying to sabotage you. Yeah. One, four, two, have faith in your abilities. All right, we've got Mini Cooper. 2020, stay focused. And we've got Grey Eyes. German. Auntie. And we've got your efforts will soon pay off. We got altered documents. Angel numbers, look out for the signs and synchronicities. Alchemist, okay. Tag team, hiding something. This is a group of individuals. <sighs> Scottish. East African, 818, a new dawn on the horizon. 6-7, there's someone in your energy. With someone, something about an auntie. North, someone in the 60s or late 70s, or someone born in the 60s or late 70s. All right, we've got a sister, Congolese, 707 Divine Support. We've got White Car, African, Green Eyes, 
Ghanaian, and we've got foot tattoo. Citrian, 21 to 30. All right, your reality is your own and what you make of it. We've got 1133 Alchemist, good omens ahead. I feel like the divine could be hiding something here from you, Alchemist, because they want to surprise you. Alchemist, you've gone through a lot. I can only imagine the trauma that you may even be dealing with as a result of everything you've gone through. Trust issues is an understatement. Just imagine everyone in your life that you ever knew just working against you, trying to sabotage you, trying to bring you down, trying to have the worst done to you. People who knew that people were scheming and plotting in your life and no one said anything to you. They were just waiting for things to unfold in your life in the worst ways. People really watched you like they were watching a show. Many people are going to have to live with this guilt for the rest of their life for what they participated in doing to you. It's as simple as that. Because this was all unjustified and uncalled for. Nobody chose to use their mind. Everyone just went with the flow. They went with the crowd. How can you go with the crowd and try to destroy someone's life? How? How can you sit back and watch somebody suffer and not do nothing? How can you sit back and allow people to spread rumors about someone? Not even get to know that person. And if these people did know who you were and know that everything these people were saying about you weren't true, none of these people spoke up for you. None of these people defended you. None of these people came to you and told you, hey, do you know this person said this about you? This person's doing this about you. No. These people are just, they just stood by. They all just stood by and allowed it. Because they all stood to gain off your demise. It just says enough about these people. It says enough about who they are. And all the roles they all played in your life. Your pain and suffering alchemist in this lifetime was never in vain. It was never in vain. It was to teach you the lessons that you needed to learn about those around you. And these people that participated in trying to sabotage your life and bring you down. They're about to be taught a very big lesson. A very major lesson by the divine. Karma never forgets. And for everything these people put you through, believe me, Alchemist, it's going to be returning back to them in whichever way it manifests in their life. We've got works with children and one full, full, full Alchemist. A judgment call is being assessed in the ethers. There's a lot of individuals who are under judgment at this time. Everyone that participated in this, everyone. There's no escaping the judgment here. There's no escaping the wrath of the divine for what these people did to you. We've got no call ID. Someone may try and contact you on no call ID here. We've got separation. And we've got big ego. Yeah, miss, this is almost over. Okay. We got good intentions, silent moves. Someone here wants to try again. We got mental health and we got control. It feels like someone here was trying to control your mind. Someone here was trying to control your life. Every move you made in your life, who was in your life, because they were actively sending people to come to your life. Just to see how far people would go, it just doesn't sit well with me, honestly. Can I, I just can't imagine a group of people really sitting down and saying, I, want, I don't want this one person to have peace in their life. I want this person to suffer. I don't want this person to be happy. I don't want this person to have any love in their life. I don't want this person to have any peace in their life. I don't want this person to have any stability in their life. And they're all going with it. Like it was justified. Knowing if it was them, they would not want that. It just never sits well with me that people really act like this, behave like this, and think it's okay. But these people are really living in their own illusions, their own delusions, to think what they were doing to you was okay, and to think they were going to get away with it. It's only by the grace of God, Alchemist, and the strength of your ancestors that you had the courage and the strength to overcome all the attacks these people sent to you, all the obstacles that they planted in your life. You had to trust your intuition about these individuals here. 